Good morning everyone and welcome from Annud. Today I will be taking you with me so you can see what my day usually looks like. Um, what my day looks like when I'm recording as well on my own. So we're gonna spend all day together. So yeah, come with me, see what's coming up in this vlog. Uh, we have a one important mission today. But for the moment, see what's coming up and see you in a minute. And I'm gonna explain to you how you can get a card from us guys. It's written by hand by me and Danny. We are Danny and Diggy, an English-Polish couple from the UK. We have quit our jobs to follow our dream of exploring Thailand for the next year. If you love good food, views, beaches, and want to see more of this beautiful country, join, join us on, on our, our journey. journey. Hey guys, come and spend a day with me. So, we have one important mission today very important mission today i have to send a postcard guys i need to send a postcard to one of our subscribers so i couldn't find the post office for ages so i'm going to prakanon first this is first mission today we're going to prakanon leaving from Onnut now and then we see what we can do <laughs> uh, i'm catching a bts to prakanon it's only 15 minutes walk to the main post office. I could walk really, but I want to save my energy. It's super hot today and I will be out all day. So yeah, I've been to, I think, three post offices around Onud and everywhere they told me that I cannot send a postcard. This was just a post office. It said a post, but it was, this was just for the parcel. So I have to find one where I can actually can send that parcel. I didn't know this was going to be so difficult. But I found main post office. Let's just get So I hope you're going to like this kind of vlog. If you do, please give a thumbs up so I know and I can make more of these vlogs. Oh, BTS coming. Right, I made it. Nobody got up here on this stop. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go and explore Prakanong for a little bit. I don't know where I'm going. I need to find that main post office so I can send the card to one of our lovely subscribers. only three minutes away so this is gonna be nice and easy walk I'm not sure how the post office works so bear with me I've got my card with me uh, so yeah I have to send it I'm gonna explain to you how you can get a card from us guys it's personalized it's written by hand by me and Danny uh, so yeah, let's go in and send that card. I have no idea how it works around here. So I have to get a number somewhere, but I don't know where. Look, uh, Todd, I'm Annie. Get a number. Teen. Ah, oh, okay, Captain Car. Right, got my number. Uh, oh, so this was very very easy uh, now we have to find some food because I need breakfast guys let's go I think I'm gonna take you to Chinatown uh, I've been thinking about getting myself rainy season shoes I cannot walk in a flip-flops because I keep sliding all the time feet get really dirty so I'm looking for some I'm looking for some rainy season shoes. Not sure what yet. I've seen a lot of stuff over there which would be suitable for the rainy season footwear. Uh, so yeah, let's go to Chinatown. There will be loads of exploring as well. Let's get some food over there because the food in Chinatown is amazing. 
then you can see what I get up to. We might do more shopping later on if I have enough energy. Let's go. So now we have to catch MRT to Chinatown. I'm in Asok, so let's go. I actually find it really, really cool. I can now travel to some places, for example, like Chinatown, without even looking at the Google map. I know exactly which station to take where, where to change and stuff like that. I'm really proud of myself. Right, so guys, I'm in Wat Mankon and Marathi station now. This station is huge. It's easy to get confused. So basically, if you want to go to Yaovarat Road, take exit one. Right, let's go and get some shopping done. I need to get breakfast as well. So don't worry, food will be involved. <laughs> right, guys, I made it. Hongnam, toilet first. And now we are off to explore Chinatown, do a bit of shopping and have something to eat. There's one particular thing I want to eat is Khao Man Gai, but if I see something different I haven't had yet uh, around here, then I might go for it. We've got here some fried breadstick Chinese donuts. Ooh. Sorry, I'm not looking in the camera. It's so much stuff around here. I just, I'm just looking everywhere. But that's not the common guy I wanted, so let's carry on. I'm on main Yobarat Road now. So busy. There is always so much going on around here. I, I love Chinatown. That's the one reason why I love it, because you come here different times a day and there will be so much more different stuff than when you've been here before. It's great. I, find, I finally found the road where I wanted to come uh, with the food I wanted to eat. So let's hope they're there, let's hope they open guys. Because that cow man guy is the softest ever. Yes, they, they're there, they're there. Danny's gonna be so jealous. <laughs> So this is Khao Mangai tea soup, guys. The best Khao Mangai. In my opinion, anyway. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. The food has arrived. Check this out. The sauce in here. The sauce is, guys, it's amazing. I keep saying amazing all the time. I know, I know some of you laugh at this, but it's just like easiest word pops into my mouth. You can taste a little bit of soybean, I think, in this sauce. It's spicy, it's a lot of ginger and garlic. It's super delicious, really good. And the broth, the broth is cooked in a massive pot with some vegetables. It's nice and clean, it's super yummy. Let's try some of this broth now. Oh yeah, oh yes, you can taste a lot of chicken bones in there guys. Mm. It's like the broth you would cook at home. Okay, okay. okay. Right guys, I've got some chicken, I got some rice. Let's go. Oh yeah. I really really like the rice here because it's a little bit sticky but it's so light it's super soft chicken is not as tender as usually is but it's still delicious nice clean meat and that blood cake guys I love blood cake I asked specifically lady if she if I could have some I said I need I might have I just pointed out because I don't know what the black uh, blood cake is in Thai. If you know, please let me know down in the comments. I love blood cake. Oh yeah. So soft. It's nice and jelly consistency. It's so clean. Perfect. Perfect breakfast, guys. Absolutely delicious. Mm. But check out 
everywhere I'm sitting, guys. I'm sitting in the middle of Chinatown. People walking around, taking pictures, shopping. There's loads of fruit carts, loads of food is everywhere. Kotot ka? Kao lai ka? Kao lai ka? Ani, ani? So all of this food and water was hoxi ba, 60 ba. Oh, kap kung ka. Ani, 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 kao man gai? Kao man gai ti sut? Aloi mag mag. Kap kung ka. Right. Let's go and do some shopping now. Right guys, I'm gonna turn you around now and you can see what I see. We're gonna walk through the busy market in Chinatown. Uh, link will be in the description, of course, so you can find it. But look how beautiful all this fruit looks. Cherries are so expensive. Oh. Yeah, so we're going into a really, really busy area. There's so much. So much food, food I have never tried before. There's a lot of dried stuff which I'm not sure what it's for as well. Oh, good looking cow camo. Right, let's just go and find some shoes, I think. This, this could be a good option for, for rainy season shoes, <clears throat> but I want something a little bit more elegant. Uh, these look nice and comfy. Motorbikes are dry. Motorbikes are everywhere, guys. Let's go. There's only one way to find out where we're going if we're gonna carry on walking. If we can find some shoes, I don't know. Be careful if when you walk here because there is a lot of motorbike driving around and they do drive quite fast sometimes. There you go. Motorbikes, bikes, trolleys, literally everything around here, guys. Maybe, maybe I just get something like this. Because this is gonna hold my feet in one place. So look at all these cute little shoes. I really like them, but I don't think I would be actually wearing them. Oh, they look so comfy, they're so soft. You also get really, really cool shop with, shops with a lot of accessories and like a pin. So it's a little bit less busy here, but I just love, you can literally get anything around here. I just love walking into shops and see what they got. They got so much stuff. These look super cute, but these are not gonna be very good for material for the rainy season. Check these ones out, they are so cool. I wouldn't wear it myself, but I love it on other people when they wear it. It's so cute. Tons and tons of these shoes. I wish I'd be brave enough to wear something like this. I'm more of a plain person, unfortunately. <laughs> I just found a pair I liked and it's only wholesale, so be prepared that some of these places they only have wholesale guys not many people speak English here so I have to practice my Thai I did basically ask Chan Su Neng Dai Mai Dai Mai Ka and they kind of understood that I'm looking just for uh, one per <laughs> shoe so that's good Guys, I've got bad news and good news. The good news is I know uh, I know what shoes I want. The bad news is there is no there is only wholesale around here. So lovely lady directed me to go this way and we're gonna find something. Fingers crossed. There is some clothes around here, uh, hats and bags. So you never know, maybe. Kotopka, video Daimaika? Daimaika! Ah, oh, look at these ladies, they look so pretty! Hello! Kakumika! <laughs> right. Let's find some shoes for Diggy. Why I'm buying, why I'm buying uh, the shoes like that? It's uh, because it's so difficult to walk in the rainy season, guys. Yeah, it's very, very difficult to walk around Bangkok when your feet are wet. You cannot walk fast at home. 
I have never been here. This is huge, guys. I'm just crossing the road now and going into the new area. Well, this is turning into a very unsuccessful shopping trip for me, but look how much stuff is around here, guys. Accessories, a little bag, bags, little shopping bags, um, little jewelry, flowers and knickknacks from home. I bet ladies gonna love this vlog. <laughs> Loads of different bags, but not shoes in this, no shoes in this area. The jewelry as well. Loads of it. Look, whole shop. <laughs> right, so I had no luck with shoes. We have to move on somewhere else. Let's go. <laughs> Right guys, so this was very unsuccessful trip, shopping trip, but don't worry, uh, I'm not giving up, if you know me, I do not give up easily, so we are going to continue our shopping trip and I'm going to take you somewhere else, hopefully find some shoes as well, <laughs> fingers crossed. Right, I'm getting out of Chinatown now, uh, we're going to go to, we're going to still go shopping, so don't worry, I'm not giving up that easily. There is a mall around Pratunam where they sell cheap clothes. Uh, I might even buy Danny a present. And they might have some shoes there, I'm not sure, but we will check it out. But at least I can buy something. Let's buy Danny a present. He's working very hard. I'm just walking, walking around, <laughs> so he deserves a present. <laughs> 